Hi there guys, welcome back to my channel. We are going to work on daily spread for, oh goodness, I guess it's going to be Tuesday, March 1st. Oh, wow. I can't believe it already. Tuesday, March 1st. So, I wanted to do some bright spring fun. I'm going to... I'm a little slow here. I'm just pulling out all the things. So I've got these beautiful strips of wildflowers that came from my scrapbook stash. I really like them because they're like cut out. This is something that is so rare, you guys. <laughs> these are Spring Garden Paper Whispers from Mrs. Grossman's Paper Company. The copyright on this is 2001, you guys. So these are um, <laughs> these are older, but I thought they would be beautiful on the bottom of the page with some really pretty boxes. And I was gonna pull in some of I don't know now though. Um, yeah. Amber plants are day, layering basics. Yes, because we have these beautiful swatches. Yeah, I think I'm gonna do these coral colors and yellows right here from Amber Plants are Day, layering basics. Then I've got some Calva Plan, Live Love Posh, Ammo Jo, Jojo Plans. These are all uh, small sticker companies. So we're just going to see what happens. I have not used very many of Amber Plants or Day. And I want to make sure that what I'm pulling out of here, whatever I pull out is matching what I'm putting from here. These kind of, no. I don't know, these are very realistic. So maybe I'll just do some boxes and shapes. Okay. Well, let's start with, I'm going to put this down. So I want to run it. Probably from that edge to this edge. So I'm going to go ahead and just trim it so that I'm not having a crazy amount. And you can see I've got some, some ghosting from my Sharpie pinpoint. My Sharpie blah, 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 blah. Not pinpoint, fine point. From my Sharpie fine point. Um, let's see. So we've got kind of the coral, the yellow, so maybe some like dark burgundy. Oh, these blues would be beautiful, you guys. Uh, I'm, I'm, I've been using a lot of the blue lately too. And I think I need some of my, watch, they're not gonna be in this drawer that's next to me. I need some of my labels to, Cover the back of those stickers. Where did I put them? Oh, who knows? Maybe they're in here. I'm still not quite organized yet, guys. I apologize. I still don't have my life together. <laughs> I'm still working on getting my craft room all the way organized. I had lots of great tips shared on my comment requesting um some tips for for organization for all the supplies uh so these are avery shipping labels they have true block so true block is important because i'll show you guys on the back here it um let me tear it up it's gray so you do not see through this sticker at all I will use these sometimes if I am having um, issues like this. And I know that I'm going to use this down here. No, not that. Hold on. Where'd it go? That's not the right size. Did I lose it? In my, my melee? Guys, I'm a mess tonight. This is not long enough, though. So I must have knocked it down somewhere, is all I can think. But I'm not seeing it. Hmm. Well, this is going to be a fun video. A very fun video. Since I'm not finding it. Okay. 
well. Okay, I found it. It ran away from me, but I found it, guys. Okay, so I thought we would do this dark blue with the, the fun bright colors. Um, yeah, I'm definitely gonna need this blocking underneath here, otherwise that's gonna show through. So I'm gonna go ahead and just lay these stickers on here that I wanna use. I'm probably just gonna do two big ones, no. A big one and a small one in the blue. And then maybe I'll do Maybe I'll do this burgundy color. Okay, my daughter popped home from work. And so I paused for a moment to talk to her. And while I did that, while I talked to her, I finished putting down um, the squares I'm gonna use. So I'm gonna go ahead and just cut these out. I know it's extra work and it's a daily sheet. Uh, you would you don't have to do this guys. This is not a necessity. It's just something that I like to do because I don't want to see The ghosting from my pens now with that said I do refrain from using my Sharpie fine points unless I absolutely have to I was not thinking when I used that on that last spread. And when I do use them, I try to use them on stickers. So like if I have a box like this down, I'll use my Sharpie fine point in there because then I know it's not going to ghost through on my next planner page. Just a little tip for you guys. If you know you're gonna to wanna to use a certain colored Sharpie, make sure you put down uh, stickers in the spots where you're going to want to use it and that'll keep you from having to worry about that ghosting all right so that's that avery true block just labels shipping labels speaking of shipping labels i got a couple packages ready to go out tomorrow for uh happy mail giveaways or Actually, I should stop calling them happy mail giveaways because they're not really happy mail giveaways. I mean, I'm sure that people are happy when they get them. Um, but they're giveaways that I do when I when I reach certain levels on my Instagram or my YouTube or sometimes I'll just ask a question in one of my videos. And when people respond, I will do a... a a randomizer for the comments and then whatever number pulls up on the randomizer I sort the comments by most recent and then I start at the bottom the first person that commented and count up and whatever that randomizer says I don't know what I want to do I kind of want to leave this butterfly I don't know I don't I'm not big on mixing the cartoon feel so I'm gonna put that like that and then I'm going to peel this beautifully cut sticker oh, I guess I should have kind of maybe a little higher or lower I think it's beautiful just like that I don't think it's going to matter it's such a pretty sticker though. It's so realistic, you guys. And I'm gonna take one of these. So tomorrow, I know I gotta go to the post office. I'm gonna be doing a bunch of filming. Um, I don't know that we have a whole lot of other stuff going on. I'm gonna have to do some up there because that's big. <laughs> This crazy girl. 
Um, let me see. Let's. Uh, I really want I want more yellow. I don't want just one yellow. I guess I can put that right over that. Make my reminders pop. This would cover a big portion of that. And then I could. That's good. Let's do that. Just working with what I got. Just working with what I got. So can you guys believe it's already March? I can't. The time is just going entirely too fast for me. I can't hardly handle it, you guys. It's going to be time for me to choose another word. I decided I was going to do quarterly words. My, my first quarter was reset. I really, I might need to take myself like a week off in March and just like, I'll have my stencil by then. That's a whole nother story. <laughs> I'll have my stencil for the pattern that I want in my craft space by then. So I'll be able to um, stencil my room at some point this, this month. No, did I not get it? Oh, I didn't get it all off. Um, so... Maybe I will. Maybe I'll just take, even if I don't take a whole week, maybe I'll just take like four or five days. We'll see. So I make sure I have enough time to um, get all the things done. I don't want to use that, but I kind of want to put a flower there too. So I am going to pause and grab my pressed florals. Okay, I did not opt for my pressed florals. I opted for this little homemade book of, of flowers because I knew there were some more realistic looking ones in here that might pair better with like this cardinal. It's, I don't know. My other choice would be to look at, I have some Abuja stickers that might, I don't know. What if I put that up there? I feel like it's just not realistic looking enough with what's going on down here. Maybe I just need a fun quote. That's probably what I should have grabbed was a quote book. Now oh, here's some quotes. We might have what we need after all. I'm so excited. I got the shipping notification on my Happy Planner order from the spring release. So I'm very excited, guys. I think I kind of want to pull in some of these. I don't, I don't know. Would it be silly to pull those in? I'm not certain yet. That rose gold. There's some not rose gold though. I don't know. I can't make up my mind. That's nothing new. But yes, very excited. Very, very excited. So it should be here by Friday. So it's a very good possibility. Oh, look at these fun little stickers. Um, it's a very good possibility that I'm going to have a haul video for you guys this weekend. <laughs> At some point. Hopefully. I mean, I'm not going to make any promises. I'm hoping it gets here 
I'm hoping I get to film the video for you guys. Okay, I just mixed in a bunch of weird colors in there. I don't know if that works well or not. We shall see. I kind of like this Let Your Dreams Blossom because I like this burgundy color and it's kind of the color that I've got pulled in with that dark like purple and blue. I'm thinking that's probably going to be the quote that I go with. Yeah, that's going to be the one. So I'm going to take this and I'm going to light out on the edges here. Just so it doesn't show through on my sticker. And I can either, let's see, I can run it down to the bottom touching this or I can run it up high. I think I'm going to run it down touching that. Oops. Over just a little bit so it covers up all those lines. There we go. And now this yellow is standing out glaringly. So maybe I won't use... I'm sorry, Amber. Maybe I won't use that layering sticker. Hopefully it'll peel up without an issue. Oh, that's lovely, Amber. I love that. Oh, no, it's tearing a little bit. My fault entirely, doggone it. Yeah, I should have thought about that before I laid it down. That's okay. That's all right, so. Since we've got yellow on there, let's just go ahead and, it's not a mistake, we're just going to work around it. We're going to go ahead and pull in this yellow on the priority box. No. I should have put that yellow behind all that. Hmm. That's so dark compared to these yellows, I feel like. I feel like these are like a little lighter yellow. Is it just me and that's like a darker yellow? Maybe it is just me. I don't know. I feel like that's a lot of yellow, though. You guys, you know what I am. I'm going to do this. I'm going to take up that remember, and I'm going to put down a different one. I'll just put down a different word there. It is going to tear my page some. I'm going to have to sacrifice that sticker. Oh, maybe not. Maybe I can save it. Look at me. I'm trying to save my sticker. Because I really do want to use these. I don't know. Okay. So let's find a different word to put there. We're going to end up pulling in those rose gold that I wasn't going to pull in to begin with. Huh? Because that's what's in this focus sermon. Oh, here we go. Reminder. And I can just, I'm going to go ahead and just tear that. There we go. That's better. And reminder. And I'm going to say right here, we're going to do plan on it. There we go. And then down here, I'm going to layer that inside that box. No, I'm not. Because that says to do. So I'm going to leave to do and just put checklist right below it. 
to do checklist. And then I'll make myself a little checklist here. Yeah. Nice. Okay, guys. So that is, um, again, Spring Garden Paper Whispers from Mrs. Grossman's Paper Company. Um, long, long time ago. <laughs> long, long time ago. And I'm pretty sure my boxes, yeah, they came from Tell of a Plan. One of my go-to sticker books. I think I ended up with three of these because I use them so often. I don't know whose bright idea it was to uh, create sticker books with just boxes, but I mean, I'm all in. I'm there for it. I'm there for those sticker box books. Okay. There we go. If you guys have not yet had the opportunity to subscribe to my channel, please take a moment to do so if you are enjoying the content. Hit that notification bell if you want to get notified when I'm uploading a new video so that we can hang out together and be on the lookout for some new things coming. I'm going to be doing some more flip throughs of sticker books. I've had a couple requests for, uh, I believe it was Stargazer and the Let Your Heart Wander. I'll be doing flip throughs of those soon. If there are other sticker books that you would like to see individual flip throughs for, please let me know. Any particular ones from the Happy Planner Spring release and I'll see if I am getting that sticker book and I'll plan it on my calendar to do a flip through of it. Uh, if there's anything else that you guys would like to see, I actually am very excited to be starting something, as I said, a little new. I'm going to start trying to do a little bit more junk type planner journaling. I don't know if that makes sense or not. If you guys are aware what junk journals are, uh, they're more like collage, -y, collage -y type spreads with a lot of different media, scrapbook, scrapbooking paper, stickers, um, just odds and ends and bits and pieces. And I, I love to collage. So I'm looking forward to kind of giving that a go in some of my spreads just to see what it feels like because it looks like fun. Anyways, ciao for now. I will see you guys in the next video. Thanks for all your support. See you soon.